guys going someplace? I'm leaving. Oh. Well, uh, let me do a little investigative reporting. So I learned at Quantico, I get a lot of use out of it. Taking stuff to the, well, I'd say you're taking stuff to Goodwill, medical books, softball, mid but really, Rick, a used toothbrush, it's, well, that would be pretty unhygienic. That's it. Call you in the morning? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, you have to call her. You live here, right? Unless... Do you want me to stay? No. I'll be fine. Okay. Call me if you need me. I will. I mean it. So, uh... What was the straw that broke the old nubs from the back there? I don't think that's any of your business. Was it the uh, thing that happened at your niece's welcome home? You know, party? actually, it was... It was a lot of things. It was our kiss. You are just so full of yourself. <clears throat> it's incredible. You know... You've been chasing me this whole time. Okay, well, not anymore. Then what are you doing here? Business. Just came by to tell you that the police report came out from the lab, the fire, the warehouse. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And you got this before me, how? Well, I have my ways, you know. I... No, don't tell me, though, because I want to guess. Um, you bribed the guy at the lab. That would be good. No, you stole it off of somebody else's desk. Yeah, if you want to hear what I have to say No. That, no? You want to know why? Because why? you are a private citizen now, Atari. You're not even a P.I. I anymore. never was a P.I. Well, then it's really none of No, it business. is my business. It's my business. I was in the fire. I took a chest full of acrid smoke just to save Danny Santos' life. It's my, it's my business. So, you want to hear what happened? It was foul play. The fire was set. Look at that. Look how big your eyeballs get when you do that. <laughs> That was set? Yes. Are you sure? Well, now I have your attention. Now I do. Yeah, it was set. You know how that works, right? Someone takes a match to a combustible material, and then the sparks start to happen, and things start to sizzle, and the fire and the flames get higher and higher, and the heat just, well, grows unbearably until finally, just finally, official word is arson. arson. yeah. Then you have to ask yourself, you know, who said it? Was it Carmen? Was it Danny? I don't know. Maybe it was neither one of them. Right. Maybe. It, maybe it wasn't. But then you have to ask yourself, why was the fire set? You know, were they trying to destroy the warehouse or the stuff inside the warehouse? I know. I think you should go. You know why? Because I'm getting a little sick and tired of this obsession with the Santos family. Just work with me on this case. <sighs> Just work with me. Come on, it's good. Attempted murder, arson, mob connections. Think of all the late stakeouts we could have to get those late nights, eating stale donuts <laughs> and cold pizza. It would be fun. Horrible, lousy, burnt coffee to rot our guts. To a girl's heart. Not just any girl. Not just any girl. Just come on. What do you got to lose? Really? No. 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 Yeah, no. Oh, nope. no. Well, I'm glad you spelled it out for me. That's cool. I'm going to just work on the case myself. No, you're not. Do me a favor. No, you're night not. Night to Jude, right? Make sure you tell Jude who it's from, the kiss, and the guy that brought him into the world. Okay. Don't do this. Take care. He's got my answer. Thanks. Hey! I will 
allow you to work with me on the case, and not for the reasons that you think. Okay, I want to keep an eye on you, make sure that you don't railroad Danny again. Whatever. Okay. It's nice to have you back. 